The governor also pointed out that the number of new cases each day continues to climb because more testing sites are popping up, he says, and are extending their hours across Central Florida. That includes the testing site at Osceola Heritage Park. Sky 6 caught a glimpse of cars lining up there earlier today. And as News 6's Amanda Castro explains, the demand for testing is still very high right now. Cars lining up at Osceola Heritage Park Saturday morning as people wait for free COVID-19 testing. But there weren't as many vehicles as we saw earlier in the week. At times, the line wrapping around the park. People lining up hours before testing began. We don't start till 9 o'clock. We've had to shut the lines off at 730 because it had that many people already in line. Osceola County Health Department officials say turnout at the park shows the demand for testing is high, and that's why they extended their hours this weekend and are continuing to offer free testing here next week. We're doing everything we can to try to track it and try to uh, get it under control and by offering this testing. Assistant Administrator Brett Smith says they offer more than just testing at this site. Everybody that comes through the line gets a lesson on wearing your face mask, washing your hands, and using sanitizers. We educate them as they come through the line. Amanda Castro, Getting Results, News 6.